A century old former church in the East Village that once fell into disrepair has been transformed into this glistening craft beer tasting room. Our ABC tennis reporter John Horn shows us how the Lost Abbey Brewing Company found its newest home through troubling times. All right, done this once or twice, once or twice. Jenna Sloan has poured thousands of beers for San Diegans over the years, but most not in a place as unique as this. The stained glass that's like lit from behind, that was custom made for us. These statues are, I think, imported from Italy. So we have our sinner and our saint. Jenna's the GM of the Lost Abbey Craft Brewery's newest location called The Church. It's inside the shell of a century old building that used to serve as a church but had fallen into disrepair. It's a $1 million project that opened last month. The church is a historic landmark built in 1906, but not in this spot. It was moved from over in that corner by those pipes right there for its new beginning. The reason it's called the Lost Abbey is because we never had a real church or a real abbey building. Um, but welcome to the welcome to the new church and the new abbey. So we're now a found abbey. Lost Abbey co-founder Tommy Arthur envisions the tasting room as a neighborhood spot for those in the skyscrapers that surround it and a place for Padre fans to hang out before heading to Petco Park a couple blocks away. The project makes for a bright spot amid the pandemic and annual inflation soaring to 7%, hitting craft brewers for necessities like barley and cans. Just about every single thing that we buy is up in price and there's some surcharge things, there's some long-term things. Uh, it's been really ridiculous. Still, he sees a bright future inside this former East Village church that has a new life. John Horn, ABC 10 News. That looks great. Crews are continuing to work on an outdoor taco shack as well, an eating area next to the church. Tacos and beer, not bad. It should be done by March, just in time for baseball season.